Hey guys, how's it going? It's Chris here, and I have a very quick video for you. It's just a simple unboxing, but it's not for any kind of a new product or anything. It's actually from something, it's actually of something from my childhood. Uh, this was, I would consider to be my favorite toy as a kid, if not, you know, top five favorite toys. I had a lot. I used to, I was the kind of kid that grew up, you know, playing with toys all the time. I had my army men, I had my power rangers, I had other other stuff. Like I grew up with just a toy box of things and it was always getting every time we go to like a local supermarket they have one section where there were toys and like, you know, play doh and putty and just always just my mom, can I get a toy? Can I get I wanted that out oh, give me that fucking slinky mom. You know, it was always stuff like that. Um and this one particular toy, which I don't know how it fit in this box. I have no idea. It shouldn't fit in this box. Um, <laughs> I really don't feel like it should fit in this box with how big I knew it to be. But uh, I recently found this on eBay. Come on. Found it on eBay for a price that was a little bit out of my range. And I, but I knew I was getting my tax return soon and I knew that how much I was getting back was pretty much what I needed for it, but I didn't want to spend all my tax returns on it, because I obviously need that money for something else, and um, so I was waiting, I bookmarked it, and I was, well, first off, I was searching for this toy forever, you know, we're just gonna, I'm gonna open it up real quick so you guys can see, and then <clears throat> we'll talk about it, God, as a kid, dude, I remember this being so much bigger, like this, oh, okay, that's how he removed the tail, I remember this toy being absolutely massive as a kid oh bubble wrap oh, fuck. I, what are the odds that this is mine what are the odds that this is my space godzilla It was one of his, yeah, oh, wait. One of his, I thought one of his spines activated the noise. His batteries might need to be changed. It's very cold outside. Um, this is my Space Godzilla toy, dude, from when I was a kid. It uh, lights up. I think, I don't know if, I think its shoulder crystals light up, and it makes noises from its chest. But, yeah, dude, I remember this thing being an absolute jar, gigantuan, jar, gi Gargantuan. Sorry, I, I've been away for like 30 minutes. Gargantuan beast as a kid. And uh, I used to play with this thing with like my army men and my, I had other big Godzilla toys that they would fight each other. And I don't even think as a kid I saw the Space Godzilla movie. And I don't even know how I got it. It must might have been from a yard sale. It might have been you know, given to me by somebody. It might have been a random Christmas gift or something like that. Because like, yeah, he likes Godzilla. Let's grab this thing because it's here. It's cheap or whatever. So, um... And I kind of forgot about it in my adult years. Uh, and then as I was looking at stuff, I think I saw a picture or a video or something that reminded me of it. And I went, oh, that's right. I used to have this Space Godzilla toy that was the best. So I went looking for it, and I couldn't find it. I found a bunch that were like it but, and, like, newer ones in different years. But none of them, none of them, tr I couldn't remember exactly what it looked like. And none of them triggered that specific memory in my brain that said, yeah, that's it. None of them did. I found a couple that were this one. They didn't trigger it, though, because I'm like, that looks like it, but it's too small. It's like four inches. I know. I know I was a kid. I know for a fact mine was a lot bigger than four inches. So I was like, that can't be it. So I posted on Facebook just, like, despondent. Like, I, I explained the whole thing. Like, I used to have this toy as a kid. I can't find it anywhere. It looks kind of like this. If anybody knows where to get it. Within two minutes, a friend who I haven't spoken to in, like, a few months immediately commented with a link like is this it i'm like i could fucking kiss you right now yes that's it because it was the 10 inch figure and again it I, I in my head as a kid it was like this big but this makes sense for how small it was i was a little dude so and then i bookmarked it i found it the same one on ebay i bookmarked it and i was like all right i'm gonna wait for the price to maybe go down a little bit and it didn't for a couple weeks, and then it finally dropped by like 30 bucks. I'm like, oh shit, okay, I need to act on this, because I do not want to lose out on it. I want this back. 
And so I messaged the dude like, hey, can you drop it down a little bit more? I gave him a price. And I'm being vague. I didn't spend like $600 or anything. I would never do that. But it was still enough to where I went, mm, I, I don't feel like dropping that right now. But if I can get him down a little bit lower, I will do it. I'll jump on the opportunity. So he dropped like a 15% discount, which brought it down like another $22, I think. And it brought it down just into the range where I said yes. And immediately I bought it. And here we go. This is my Space Godzilla. This is where I first learned what a vagina looked like. Look at that. Look at that crease in the middle. Look at that, dude. <laughs> Who did that? What's wrong with you? Again, what are the odds that this is mine? Because like, I had it as a kid for a long time. And just one day it was gone. So I don't know if it got thrown away. I don't know. I didn't lose it. I didn't take it anywhere. Um... Henry, if you're watching this, I'm sorry, but did you take it and sell it or trade it as a kid? Because that's something you did a lot as a kid. Um, I don't know if mom and dad got rid of it, but like, yeah, it was just gone one day. So, and now I have it again. I'm so stoked, dude. This is going to be in the background. Of, it's going to be on that shelf. I'm going to find a good spot for it on the shelf. Fuck, this tail is so big. But yeah. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and... I gotta, gotta get some batteries in this thing somewhere. I don't know where the batteries go in. You, oh, you know what? You probably remove the back. You probably remove the dorsal fins. Yeah. Yeah, it takes one battery. So I'll pop that out and figure that out later. But thank you guys for watching. I'm so happy.